All right, so there's another pretty method for uh, inguinal hernia repair, and this is known as what the open tension free method for inguinal hernia repair. So, in the open tension free method, yeah, you use a mesh, and when you are covering it, you cover it without tension. I don't know if I'm speaking, all right? So, we actually talk about this method. We we'll define it to we'll talk about the steps involved. We we'll talk about the advantages of this method. Okay, we we'll talk about the key principles, indications that's when to use it, then when not to use it as a contraindications. Okay. So for the open tension free repair for inguinal hernia, we say that it is a surgical technique that uses a mesh to reinforce the weakened area without tightening the surrounding tissues. So you reinforce this area without what? Causing tension, okay? The steps involved this are, you make a small incision in the groin area, uh, you dissect, that means the hyena sac is dissected and separated from the surrounding tissues, mesh placement. A synthetic mesh is placed over the hyena defect, overlying the healthy tissues, fixation. The mesh is fixed in place with what sutures or tacks, all right? And you do this without tightening the surrounding tissues, okay? Then after you're done, you close the layers, closing layers. Advantages, it is minimally what invasive. That means you're cutting the patient, but not too much, okay? So now, because you're not cutting too much, the recovery time is quick, okay? And because you're using the mesh to reinforce the area, so the rate for it to reoccur is low, okay? Reoccurrence rate is low, okay? And there's a reduced post-operative pain, all right? It can be performed under local anesthesia, all right? It can be performed under local anesthesia. So key principles, it is actually attention free. So there's no tightening of surrounding tissues. Mesh reinforcement, it, uh, after, as I was putting the mesh there, actually what? provides additional strength to the repair, okay? Then overlap. Mesh overlap will what? Uh, mesh will overlap or healthy tissues to prevent reoccurrence, okay? Fixation. Secure fixation of mesh, and this is to prevent what? Migration of the mesh to another part. Le make the mesh leave the area which you want it to what? Reinforce, okay? Indications now. Um, if you have a primary inguinal hernia, Case indicated. Reoccurrent inguinal hernia is re indicated, uh, indicated, right? Then, if you have a bilateral inguinal hernia, it's indicated, okay? Then, for contraindications, that's like when you shouldn't use it. If you have a hernia that is greater than four centimeters wide, you don't use this method. If you have a complex hernia that is kind of like sliding or incarcerated, you don't use it. Then, poor tissue quality. All right, that's uh, if there's a damage from radiation, you don't use this method too, All right? So guys, that's it about the open tension-free repair for inguinal hernia. I'll be seeing you guys.